One of the problems with RVs is their storage space. While RVs often have a lot of storage space, the space is usually very inefficient. For example, this is our pantry area. While we have three nice big shelving areas here, the space is not very effective. When you have a shelf like this one and holding small items like the Ziploc bag, the hefty box here, small cans of soup, box of crackers, the space, they sit on the shelf and the rest of this space is wasted. So unless you have an awful lot of big boxes or carry a lot of cereal, the space isn't very effective. We're going to see if we can double up our shelf space there and double up our storage capacity. Okay, so here's what I did to fix the problem. I cut a couple of boards about this size, measuring how high I wanted the shelves to be. I can't drill into the side of this because the refrigerator is right on the other side, and I wouldn't want to put a hole in that. The other side I could put a hole in, but I just chose not to. So made a board, two boards just like this. I drop one in here on this side, and then another one, same length, same distance on the other side like that and then I cut a big board painted it the side color to match the shelving and the wood around the trailer and see if this is gonna work I had to notch it just a little bit and there we go more storage space okay so there it is as you can see, we have effectively doubled our shelf space. Pretty quick and easy there. If I take the Ziploc bag, you can see the Ziploc box now fits underneath there. And I can fit more stuff on the top shelf. So we have double the storage space without all that wasted space up above. Now, of course, I'm going to have to put some screws straight down into through this board and into this board here. But I won't want to put screws, like I said, into the side here because that's my refrigerator and I don't know how thick that is, but I can tell you that this board here is very thin. So we're just gonna put screws straight down here, boom, boom, boom. And the same on the other side to help stabilize it and keep it still. Although this amazingly is sitting quite still and quite stable right now, just sitting there, but a couple of screws there should hold it in place and give us all that extra storage space. And then we painted the wood, just kind of find a color that somewhat came close to matching the rest of the wood, so you can hardly tell. And then I've got one more to do, because I think we're just going to do two, and leave one big one so that we have space for uh, big bags of potato chips, cereal, things like that. Right, so here's how we put these together. Just got two boards. Right up there. big one right on top. This is really hard to do with one hand. And then we'll just put screws along the top here, drilling through this board into this board here, and we will avoid putting any screws into the uh, sidewall here where the refrigerator is.